If you're like me who mainly uses a Mac OS but switches to Windows from time to time, then you understand that there are pros and cons in between these two systems. Especially if you're really used to the Finder app, which is basically the equivalent of the File Explorer in Windows. In Mac OS, there's this neat built-in app called Preview, which lets the user quickly preview a file by just hitting the spacebar. And it really comes in handy. One situation that I can think of from the top of my head is when I'm selecting files for my videos. Let's say I'm editing a vlog such as this, and I have a lot of clips, but not all of those clips are usable. So I'll just easily view those clips by just hitting the spacebar on my keyboard. And then from there, I can know which file I can or cannot use. I can also use the arrow keys on my keyboard to navigate to the next or previous files. And there's also a playhead that lets me skip to a specific part of an audio or video file. Once I find a usable clip, I can just import it in my video editing software and proceed. Now things get a bit different when it comes to Windows because it doesn't have a built-in quick preview app. Same example, I'll go to my files, but since it doesn't have a built-in quick preview app like in Mac OS, I'll have to double-click on that file and open it on my default video playing app. In this case, VLC Media Player. It's not necessarily slow, but it's less quick compared to hitting the spacebar and previewing the file right away. For us content creators, or basically anyone who works a lot using computers, every second counts, right? Now, I've recently discovered a free software in Microsoft.com called Quick Look. It basically works the same as Preview in Mac, but for Windows. So in my file explorer, I'll just click on my file, hit the spacebar, and voila! It also works for PSD files, audio files, basically every other compatible media file. To install Quick Look, just go to Microsoft.com, search for Quick Look, and click on the first result. Click on Install and wait for it to install, and that's it. In some cases, it doesn't work right away, so you can just manually launch the app on the Start button, or you may search for Quick Look on the search bar on the lower left area of your screen. By the way, this is not sponsored. I just thought that I would share it with everyone else who works in both a Mac and Windows system like me. And that's it. Just a quick video for today. Don't forget to hit like if you like and comment down below if you have any content suggestions for me. And don't forget to hit subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. I need to know everything. Who and what and where I need everything. Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me. I'm curious, George. I hop in the Porsche, five and a horse. I'm ready for war. I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost. I need to know everything. Now you be.